Now the phones are literally going bonkers, so let's let's just take some calls. Who, who's on line one? Hello there. Hi, yeah. Hi, who who's that? This is Tony from Birmingham. Hi, Tony from Birmingham. Is it snowing there? No, no. Is it V cold? Yeah. Brr. What's <laughs> what's your what's your question? Basically, my question is Torval and Dean. I mean, apart from your own sport, are there any other sports that you're fanatical about? Ah, nice one. Chris? You like motor racing? I follow motor racing. I'm a bit of an oh. armchair racer. I used to do a little bit when I was a little bit younger until I right. broke my ankle doing it. Have you played on those games? Actually, yes, my husband James James has one. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you've got one. You own one. Graphics. Sue and I are well into that. You're very yeah. keen to buy one of those. Yeah. yeah. No, they look good. But armchair motor racer. Armchair. Well, how about you? Uh, my other sport's shopping. <laughs> <laughs> good one. Definitely need the elbow pads. Very, very good. <laughs> training and stamina for that. Lots of, you know, you need muscles for the legs to keep going around. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Tony, cheers for calling in. Thanks a lot. Bye. Bye. Susie. Hello, Sue. Hello there. This is Claire. Hi, Claire. Hi, how are you? I'm very well, apart from this ridiculous pink blouson <laughs> shirt. <laughs> now, who's your question for? It's for Jane and Christopher. Mm -hmm. Fire away. Okay. Do you have any skating injuries? Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> Broken hand, How long have broken we got? leg, <laughs> back, oh. middle back. Um, the worst must be if the blade just that thing. We, I had that happened a, to a friend of mine's sister. Yeah. Horrors. We came out of a lift once and Jane's heel went through my hand. So, so the blunt end of the blade. Eek. Pinned it down. Very nice. Not arguing. No. No. no, no. Oh, no. <laughs> just lifting. <laughs> oh no. No. But um, we get lots of muscle tears, and, you know, because if you don't warm up properly and it's cold in the rink and all yeah. have you. If you're not careful, or you're trying something new. Yeah. Um, it, you know, it's inevitable. You get muscle yeah. strains and tears. Have you? You've never been injured, have you, Daniel, on stage or anything? No, mate. I'm not quite as dangerous as that. <laughs> yeah. And you have the advantage of doing it just on a floor, yes. not on ice. Yes. Not this is the most dangerous thing I've ever done. To <laughs> be, in, be in the kitchen with you. Was <laughs> oh, was dangerous. Well, was, you know, was touch and go. Yeah. And they love your noisettes, by the way. Yes. The and did you like the good. vegetarian dish oh. that I... And the option. But it was no. so good, I couldn't remember. Yes, no, I We're going to go to line two. I think it's... Is it Maria? Yep. Yeah. Hi, Maria. Hi. Hi, where are you calling from? Hertfordshire. Hertfordshire, good. Don't be specific, just say the county. Now, <laughs> Maria, you're beautiful. Now, what, uh, what, what's your question? Um, my question's for Daniel. Okay. Um, Hi, Maria. Hi, Daniel. How will you spend your Christmas? Oh, nice I'll be at, at home for Christmas. I suppose I'm one of the lucky ones that I, I always get to go back to where I come from. I actually live there now, but I lived away for 16 years in Dublin. Right. Uh, and even then, I was always home for Christmas. I think if you can, it's important to be, you know, back where you were brought yeah, up. Yeah, so back to Donegal. That's what's common for yeah. me, and I, and I enjoy it. You know, yeah. I enjoy being with family and friends. In the bosom. So yeah. I'll be back at home, Ray. Cool. Yeah. And how about Jane and Chris? Where, where are you going to be? Well, we, it's right in the middle of our performance schedule. We're always oh in a hotel God. at Christmas. Yeah, we're usually oh in a hotel no. at Christmas time, so... Oh. Hello, distant subscriber. Who's that? Hi, it's Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Who's your question for? Um, it's for Jane and Chris. OK. Um, I'd like to ask them, are there any costumes that you've worn and then look back and said, I wish I'd never worn that? Yes. <laughs> yes. This, this one. <laughs> was something this, like that, I think. I once wore a pink you, number like that. You wore pink? When I was ten, though, at the time. <laughs> it was a, it was a mother, mother dressing thing. I, there's yeah. one burning question I have, Christopher, which is the trousers that male skaters wear, do they attach one end of the trouser to that end and the other to that to keep that kind of crease? In the 70s, we used to. Oh, for but the now flare. For the flare. The flare went. That used so to the hot went. Oh, yeah. OK. Cheers. <laughs> that was a burning question <laughs> answer. Thanks for calling I in. I think we've got time for one cool. fact. Go for it. To Tom and Dean. Do you think you would have been as successful if you'd had different skating partners? Ooh, um, I think... She had to think about it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Ooh, I know, I'm thinking of the answer. I know the answer. I'm thinking how to explain. No. I think that <laughs> <laughs> we must have been very compatible in, in not only the size of each other, and but just in our personalities. <laughs> in our personalities, because we, you know, we just worked so well together. Yeah. And we were both focused on the same thing. Yeah. Um, if we hadn't both had that She's discipline... She's trying to keep a serious face now. <laughs> if we hadn't both had that discipline and direction, um, I don't think we would have worked so well together. Yeah, have you got compatible star signs and stuff? I think so. Leo and Libra. Leo, very good. Leo balanced. and Libra. Good? I think balanced. I have no balanced. idea. No, I have no I idea. I would say that. <laughs> <laughs> Positive there. <laughs> two, two L's. Two, two L's. L's. That's yeah. got to be good. I know, exactly. Yeah. Now, right. the bad.
bad news is, is that we don't have time for any more calls. No, but the very good news is, <laughs> the good news is we're now joined by the fabulous Vard sisters. They were just... Yeah.